Hey guys, it's uh, Sergeant Merrill here, and we are at three months of epic beard growth at this point. And uh, I know it feels like I'm copying Woody in this concept, but damn it, I'm a lot farther than him at this point. So, <laughs> sorry Woody, the real epic beard belongs to me. <laughs> uh, for those who don't know at this point, and a lot of you do because it's, uh, it's one of the most common questions in my live streams, but uh, I'm growing this beard because it's my last chance to look like a bum before it embarrasses my kid. Because uh, right now, my daughter has uh, three more months before she comes into this world. And I'm going to be growing this thing all the way until then. <laughs> my uh, my father-in-law is actually doing the same thing. and uh, But I leave the house a lot more than him. So I think I'm dealing with a lot more of the drawbacks. Like uh, having to overdress for an event so I don't look underdressed. Or... Uh, or stopping people from handing me money at the gas station, because that's uh, that's getting awkward. <laughs> and I have to tell you, it's starting to feel a little Hebrew. It's very curly, very difficult. So, um, epic beards aren't quite as magical as uh, as some some of you younger people might think. <laughs> so, Woody, I have some advice. Uh, compliment your wife as often as possible, because it's going to be a bumpy road. <laughs> If you guys want to see the progress of this whole shenanigans on a periodic basis, let me know. I have no problem with it. Uh, like I said, it's my last chance to look like a bum, and I'm really getting there. It's uh, it's getting pretty uh, pretty bad here. <laughs> Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next live stream. Keep an eye on it. This is Sergeant Merrill out here.